Assalamualaikum my YouTube family and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are diving into Kiwi TCMS, an open source test case management system that's packed with features designed to simplify and streamline test case management for software quality teams. Whether you are a new to Kiwi TCMS or looking for tips to maximize it, its potential, this video has got you covered. Okay, so guys. चलते हैं अपनी वीडियो की तरफ तो स्टे ट्यून और ये वीडियो को स्किप मत कीजिएगा एंड तक देखिएगा थैंक यू ओके तो व्हाट यू विल लर्न इन दिस वीडियो एन ओवरव्यू ऑफ कीवी टीसीएमएस एंड व्हाई इट्स अ ग्रेट चॉइस फॉर क्यूए टीम्स एंड की फीचर्स इंक्लूडिंग टेस्ट केस मैनेजमेंट एग्जीक्यूशन एंड रिपोर्टिंग एज वेल एज द प्रैक्टिकल टिप्स फॉर इंप्रूविंग योर टेस्टिंग वर्कफ्लोज इफ यू आर इन अ सॉफ्टवेयर टेस्टिंग और क्यूए This tool can make a big, big difference in organizing and tracking your test cases effectively, very effectively. Let's start. Okay, so I am going to create new test plan where I will write my test plan. and I will select the product and I will select the version which I have created and I will show you where I have created this version type regression there is no reference link this is a testing plan for push Okay, I will close the ad and then hit save. So you guys can see here is my test plan and uh, which have ID number 7. And I already have created test cases. But to make you guys clear then that how you can uh, write a test cases in Kiwi, I will create new test cases for you. So I will write a summary. Basically this summary is a title for a test case. So I will give a title. Okay, create a route within a region. Default tester will be Myra. I will set the status to confirm because without confirm it won't let me run my test case. Confirm. I will then select the template. You guys can see the template reflected here. Also I will select the product. The product logistics module only and the priority I will go with the priority 1 P1. will select setup duration days and select testing duration automated no so it's already selected to no test case is deleted no ok close add I will hit save here is my test cases uh, sorry test case which I have recently created and now I will search search my test cases Okay, so I I just have created this test case. Create a route within a region. Okay, so now I will move to my test plan. So that was the test plan that I have created. Okay, so I will navigate to this test plan, and then here. I will add test cases which I need to run ok ok so I will I will search for the test cases you guys can see there are the the couple of test cases with, with the name of the contents that I have written in, 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 the, in the text box ok by, by hitting search, I can choose the test cases in bulk. You guys can see, select. 
and those selected selected test cases will be reflecting here as you guys can see okay so now I will create a test run for all the test cases I will select all so uh, if I will add these test cases to, to new test run it won't let me create the test run and the reason is because this is unconfirmed this is with status proposed okay so I will I will I will I will I will deselect all and I will go to this I will change the status from here from proposed to confirm and then I will select all and then create new test run and will name my test run okay logistics module only build hand mary bush build default tester myra username me and and I think yes that's it okay I will hit save and it will save my test run for bulk test cases okay so I will I can I can I can select all and change the status you can see the statuses under this status nav and you can change the status for bulk and as well as you can change the status for a single test case as I am doing right now I will I will mark it as running it will change the status here running okay so if if I will I will go to another test case and mark the status passed then it will show the status here so all the statuses that uh, uh, will be reflecting here okay so you can guys can see uh, the statuses for against the test cases so if I if I if I if I do the same for bulk and assign the status pass post it will post all set status post for all okay and then I will go to and set the status passed for all okay so it's set the status passed for all here are the stats of my currently ran test cases okay so here are total seven seven are passed okay and uh, this uh, this th this was the test run okay test run so I I have completed my test run and this uh, these are the stats also I will show you I will show you the metrics for my execution okay so you guys can see I am in the tele telemetry and under telemetry I have a testing map and then execution and then metrics here you can click so you guys can see the metrics for for my testing and you guys can see the status of all the pass or failed or any other uh, any other status test case right here you can find okay so i hope you enjoyed uh, this video and keep watching and to like and subscribe my video and i will keep posting such kind of informative videos thank you so much